Hi, hi there, Sonia from Living with Parkies. And look, I just wanted to give you a quick update on the red light uh, therapy I've been using to help me with my Parkinson's. So I use the Well Red Coronet. This is it here, a nifty little unit that's made in Tasmania. Um, and look, I've been using it for a few months now with the exception of a two week period over Christmas because I couldn't plug it in to a PowerPoint when we were camping. Um, but look, overall, I would say that I've found it to be helpful for me. So what I have noticed, sorry, that was the dog in the background. What I've noticed most of all for me has been a positive impact on my energy levels, um, which, to be honest, it's probably a mixed blessing because when I'm feeling good, I tend to go like the clappers. But that's a whole other story and has nothing to do with the coronet. That's everything to do with me not managing myself. Work in progress. Um, but yes, I've, I've found that it has a positive impact on my energy. What I keep coming back to is two walks that I did last year. One was a 10K walk which I did just prior to starting the red light therapy. And the other was a 21K walk up Mount Wellington for the Point to Pinnacle that I did with friends and colleagues and family to raise awareness for, for young onset Parkinson's disease. So the 10K, as I mentioned, was on relatively flat ground. It was done with friends. Um, I was completely cactus after that walk, shattered for about a week. Physically and mentally, I was really scared, to be honest, because I was thinking, if I'm like this now, after a 10K, what in goodness sakes name is going to happen to me after 21K, up a whopping great mountain? So, yeah, I was, I was scared. Um, so four weeks later, we did the Point to Pinnacle. Not only did we finish it, but we actually did it in comfortably, pulled up in good shape, uh, held it together for an after party we had at our house, which I assumed I'd be completely cactus, but I was actually fine. Physically, my body, my muscles recovered really well. Uh, I was tired though, and I was tired for about two weeks but I wasn't completely knackered and exhausted in the way that I was after the 10K. So as far as I'm concerned, that's a huge tick. Um, so I think where I've landed with red light therapy is that it's part of the answer to my treatment plan. So it's a intervention that I'm going to continue using. Yeah. So that's from my perspective, for what it's worth. I hope it's helpful. Okay, cheers, bye.